Welcome back guys, my name is Oase, welcome to another video on the channel. Today's video is going to be about one programming tip. Now before we start a video, I want to say if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. And if you like the video, smash that like button. Alright, so I've been getting a lot of questions about how we follow your video on Java or whether it's on JavaScript or any other tutorial I've done on programming. And people say, oh, we write our code, but it, it actually matches to your code, but it doesn't work. Now, to answer that question, I'm making this video. Now, there is a way that you can compare two codes. So, pretty much all my tutorial code, source code, is available on my GitHub account. I'll drop a link in the description, check it out. And you can download uh, the source code of all the tutorials I've done on my YouTube channel. Now let's say you have downloaded the code and you are reading both codes like you have one class here and another class here and then you will basically read through that what is the difference between the code you read in and then the code you downloaded from my GitHub account. Now instead of just reading both and then you probably miss the semicolon and then you can't just you know read it and by going through the code you won't realize that oh you missed the semicolon. Now, to fix this problem, I want to show you a cool website where you can compare two codes. Now, I'm going to copy this code from here. I'm going to press Ctrl C and then we're going to go to that website, which is diffnow.com. So D I W F N O W.com. I drop a link in the description as well. Well, just want to say that this is not a sponsored video or anything. I just use this website to compare my codes. Now I'm going to paste that original code here and then I'm going to paste the same code here but I want to make a change to this code. So I want to delete this semicolon and I want to delete this curly brace. Now let's say this is the code I have written and I just messaged the guy whoever I watched the tutorial on YouTube or any source code, right? So I would just say, man, I wrote your code the same way you wrote in the video but it doesn't work. So what I can do now to make sure that it, these codes match, I can compare these two codes. Now we have pasted both codes. We know that we have uh, deleted the semicolon here and the curly brace, but maybe you don't know because you have written the code. Uh, so we can compare that, right? So I'm going to click on compare. It is going to read both files and it's going to highlight the lines where you have a problem, where you have a difference between these two codes. Now let's look at the code. So the, this is the original code that we, we know that this is the file we're going to match. So it says line 27 is yellow highlighted and then we have this other highlight on the yellow. So that means we have a difference on this line to the both of these files, both of these classes. Now as you can see we missed this curly brace so it's giving us an highlight here. Next, we missed the semicolon, so that's why it's highlighting as well. If you run into a problem where you have watched the tutorial on YouTube and then you find out that, oh, this code doesn't work, the, the, the guy who made the tutorial had written the wrong code, but it works in a video, but why it's not working on my computer? So what you can do, you can just uh, come here, write your own code here, and then download the original code, and then you can easily find out the difference between your code and the code you downloaded from someone else's GitHub or whether it's a book code, whatever you file you would download online. So this is the this is just a quick video. I just wanted to give you guys a tip. I'll be doing a lot more videos about programming tips and tricks and like like this one, right? It's a short video. So that's about it for this video guys. And yeah, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Chase.